The Minister of Foreign Affairs, Geoffrey Onyema, has identified intelligence sharing amongst partners and the international community as key to addressing the myriad of challenges confronting Nigeria. Onyema made the remark during a meeting with the British Minister for Africa, James Doddridge, in Abuja, while he concedes that the nation is grappling with issues that border on security, economy and of late COVID-19. The Minister of Foreign Affairs, however, is upbeat that with the present stance of the federal government, there would be more much more improvement. The visiting British Minister for Africa expressed delight that COVID-19 figures are dropping and the death rates as well and assured that the United Kingdom remains committed to Nigeria's cause and the Commonwealth. But the government is um, determined and uh, tackling all these issues uh, with great uh, determination. Um, interestingly, the, the, the economy has, is showing signs of improving. Um, you know, um, over the last uh, few months, the figures have been um, uh, have been better than I think even the international financial institutions had uh, had anticipated. So that's um, a cause for optimism. And um, you know, we are also engaging, like so many other countries in the world, with the challenges of um, vaccinating our people, and um, and we're you know we're pushing ahead uh, with that. Um, Mercifully, um, our figures are, are going down. The numbers are going down, and um, and we, you know, fingers crossed, appear to, uh, you know, like the UK actually, be on the downward uh, 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 path. As ever, the issues of the day, be it be that uh, the, the the Chadian uh, crises uh, or COVID, and our strong support uh, through through Covax. Um, and it's good to see the vaccination problem uh, uh, program starting to um, uh, commence with rigour uh, here uh, in Nigeria because unless we're all protected, ultimately none of us are protected. Uh, we need to build back post-COVID, um, particularly around uh, health issues, non-COVID related, where we've seen you know, the Ebola experience showed how damaged things like maternal health were, but also the, the economic um, uh, impact of, of building back to uh, levels of growth across the continents that uh, make us blush in the UK.